This is the girls' 17-18 200-yard freestyle. In lane one at the bottom of your screen is Edwin Welsh, Reno. Excuse me, in lane one is Courtney Dean. Lane two, Sam Rados. Lane three, Alex Madsen. Lane four, your lead qualifier, Danielle Lee. Lane five, Sasha Alkin. Lane six, Megan Overy. Lane seven, Lindsey Gibson Brokop. And in lane number eight, Kara Silvis. At the 50, it's your leader in lane four out front, Danielle Lee with a 26-25-62. Danielle Lee, uh, local for us at Swimming World, we covered the uh, AZ State Championships back in the fall, and she was the winner in this 200 freestyle. Also has a mean butterfly as well, as she is now a body length ahead of the rest of these girls here as they approach the 100 mark. Halfway split, 52.87. She's going to be way faster than her 152.5 this morning. Right with her this morning was Sasha Alkin also with a 152, but Danielle Lee looking very, very comfortable out front with 75 yards left to go. Alkin not letting her get too far, staying right at her feet. We'll see if she can turn it on in that final 50. Your leader continues to be in lane four. That's Danielle Lee with a time of 121.46. The Far Western record is 151.16. She's got to come home in about 29.7. Both ladies, both very close to the current Far Western record, which is a 151.82. Only a second off of that cut this morning. And Alkin making her move here on this last 50. She was still three-fourths of a body length behind going into that final 25, but she's brought it down to about an arm's length. But your champion, Danielle Lee, in lane four, 150-51, a new Far Western record, followed by lane number five, didn't get that time in third place, 154-09 for lane three. That's a new record right there to start the meet off with a 150.51 for Danielle Lee.